It just breaks my heart that he's not going to see this money. Today, Mary Bruton simply avoids the problem by walking right past the mailboxes outside to make a hand delivery inside. But getting around the anger she's feeling right now proves to be a little bit more difficult. If they could see how sick he is, someone who went to Desert Storm to defend them, to defend the pile of junk that they are, and them do this to him, I hope they're rotten hell. If Bruton sounds a little emotional right now, there's definitely a reason. You see, her 45-year-old son, Bill, is fighting kidney failure and just had an open heart surgery. To help out financially, she phoned more than 100 friends and relatives. So I started a benefit drive for him, pennies from heaven, with some get well cards, asking everybody to mail him a little money or a check, money order, whatever they wanted to do. Within a week, Bruton was shocked to find that her mailbox was filled with dozens of donations for her sick son. Then on Monday, she was even more shocked to learn that the mailbox she had used at the post office had been broken into and the money inside was gone. So now we're left with two big questions. Number one, how did the two suspects manage to get inside the mailbox when obviously the lock is okay? And two, just how much money did they get from a man who's fighting for his life? When I told him this morning, he was concerned about the money I had lost. I said, no, darling, it's going to get even better. God works in mysterious ways. It's going to get better. Don't worry about that.